Hi guys and welcome to TechBased. In this video, we're going to talk about the latest Windows 11 Insider preview build for the dev channel, which is the build 23575. And in this build, we have a few improvements and also fixes for the Windows 11 operating system. And we're going to try to cover them all in this video. If you enjoy videos like these, please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the TechBased channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. So let's begin with the video. First of all, Microsoft is testing out some new start menu changes. And we've talked about this before, but basically they're trying out grouping recently added apps on your PC into a folder under the recommended section of start. And this can be enabled if you watch one of my previous videos. But of course, keep in mind that this only works with recently installed apps and they will group up inside the recommended section of the start menu. If you right click on your desktop and then click on personalize, you'll notice that we will have a new option or a new section, which is copilot in Windows. And it says here startup behavior. And we have here a new option open copilot when windows starts when you're using a wider screen copilot opens automatically and you can turn this on or off right now this is not working it's only a placeholder slider but of course microsoft will enable this slider in future builds i think this could be interesting but i'm not sure who would want copilot to start up with windows so far it's not really that vital to have it opened because let's be honest it's not doing as many things as some users would want to but of course this option is pretty interesting i'm sure that Microsoft will add certain sections here related to Copilot in the near future. This hidden feature was discovered by Phantomotion3 on Twitter, so make sure to follow him because he finds a lot of hidden features inside Windows. And now let's talk about some fixes in this build. We have some general fixes. They fix an issue which was causing certain games to fail to launch with a OX1 error in the last two dev channel flights. Regarding Copilot in Windows, Microsoft fixed an issue causing some insiders in the dev channel using the home edition of Windows 11 Insider preview builds to find Copilot in Windows has disappeared from the taskbar. Related to the file explorer, Microsoft fixed an issue where hovering over the first picture in gallery would make a tooltip appear that would never dismiss. Fixed an issue where closing file explorer could cause an explorer.exe crash sometimes. Did some work to improve the performance of opening the context menu. Fixed an issue where the second time you open drop down menus in file explorer, you wouldn't be able to scroll it with touch. Regarding the settings app, they fixed an issue where settings home might show a prompt to sign in to your Microsoft account and fail to sign in if you try to use it, even though settings itself showed you were already signed in. And we have a final fix for the task manager, a fish an issue where the drop downs and settings would float up the screen if you scrolled. And we also have a known issue related to Copilot when first launching or after refreshing Copilot in Windows while using voice access, you'll need to use show grid commands to click in the ask me anything box for the first time. And this is basically the latest dev channel build 23575. Let me know what's your favorite fix or new change in this build. If you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe the TechBase channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. I was Emmanuel from TechBase. Until next time, have a nice day.